today I am going to be showing you how to get this beachy hair and a few different ways of how I style it. I absolutely love this look, it's so perfect for summer and beachiness and festivals. So whatever you're doing this summer, this hairstyle is great. Things you'll need to get this look, a straightener, these are GHDs that I've used for any straighteners that you can use to curl your hair will work fine. Some styling treatment oil or heat protectant for your hair. Some shine free salt spray. Some flexible hold hair spray. A couple of hair ties or hair clips that you can use to keep your hair out of the way. A comb or brush, or in my case a tangle teaser. And some fun hair accessories too. So I'm just using two pumps of the oil. Just rub it into my hands and just apply all over the hair, especially concentrating on the ends. This is just so that you don't damage your hair. You can use any heat protector that you like. And I'm just gonna comb through all my hair to make sure it's pretty tangle free. Your hair does not have to be straight, but we are going to wave it. To get the best look, we're gonna do it in three sections of the hair. I halved my hair into two sections on each side. And then I'm just going to section off the bottom third. And I'm just going to tie up with a hair tie. Same on the other side. So taking a section from the back, about one inch, you just want to go down and start going outwards, inwards, outwards, and inwards. Then taking the next section, instead of starting straight at the root, just going to start slightly down and do the same thing. You want to make sure that you're holding the styler horizontally to your hair. And then again, you get a wave. Curl outwards, inwards, outwards, inwards, and then finishing off. You want it to look like tussled. want to repeat that again. If you find that you like to have a lot of volume in your hair, then I would urge you for the second layer to start all of the waves right at the root, but I don't like too much volume so I don't start right at the root because my hair's really thick and it makes it look kind of stupidly puffy. <laughs> So I'm just letting down all my hair and because it's been tied up I'm just running a comb through it just to make sure it's sleek and smooth. I love the way this beachy look looks and I want to keep it that way for the entire day at least. So I'm just going on with some shine free salt spray and I'm just spritzing the ends and tussling the hair to make sure it's in place. And then I'm going to use some flexible hold hairspray. Oh there we go. And that completes how you get the beachy hair look. So I'm now going to show you how I accessorise and style this look. So the first look that I really like is when you just simply pull a bit of your hair to the side, put some grips in. I tend to stick to just two as a crisscross to make sure that it stays in place. Just get a flower, this just has a little clip in the back and you just clip it over the top. In there. Another really cool hairstyle idea that you can do 
for a festival -y kind of look is to get a hairband with flowers and this is just one of those elastic knitted ones you just sort of place it where you want the flowers to be tug bits of your hair out the back so it gives you this sort of puffier look and then just pin the hairband to place so you don't lose it I tend to just pin it just behind my ear so that it's not too obvious from the front just really like the way that it puffs up the hair at the back so it gives you a bit more volume you can also have this band across like hippie chic and I would tend to pull out my fringe because I don't like the way it sits underneath the band boho babe kind of style or you can do the wash woman wired headband just going to tie it around my head like so and you just tie it in a double knot because that makes it look really cute and you can just have it like this so another way of using this is to double it over so it makes a loop and what you want to do is stick the two through the loop so it makes this loop and then you want to use that as a hair tie so just pull it through and then tug on this end to make it into a loop and then you can turn this into a cute little bow And the great thing about it being wired is you can make it as cute as you like. You can even take your style to the next level with some sequins, adding a touch of sparkle into your life. Or if you want to go the cuter way, you can have a little bow. <laughs> if you're not into accessories but you do want to do something a little bit more boho, you can take little pieces from the sides of your face and then twist it and pin it. And then from the other side just do the same. So I'm just going to leave out my fringe but I'm just going to pick up this section here, twist it and pin. and then you just spray it in place. But there we have it, how to get beachy hair and how to style it. But please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this hair tutorial. Please subscribe, I do put up a new video every Thursday. And remember, what do stars do? They shine. I'm so worried about getting makeup on it. You do have to hold the curlers in a bit longer. They're not colours, they're straighteners. This <laughs> is by Philip Kingsley and this is the Elasticizer, which is an intensive super conditioning pre-shampoo treatment for all hair types. I've never tried Philip Kingsley products, but it sounds like a good fun 